Didn't do a very good job of brushing you, did I, babe? Never mind. Come on. Oh, and I didn't wash my boots. Oh, well. Dirty boots. Poo stained pony. We may as well go with the theme of the day, haven't we, Nelly? Come on. So Nelly has had a few days off uh, because of the storm, because, well, the multiple storms that keep happening that are very irritating and wet and windy and unpleasant. Uh, so I haven't ridden for a couple of days again, which sucks. Not happy about that at all. Um, so I think Madam's a bit fresh today, a little bit perky. Um, she's also annoyed because it's dinner time and she's just seen her bucket go in her stable. <laughs> she was not amused in the slightest. Um, but hopefully uh, this will work in my favour because I want to go for a nice fast one today. Um, partly because, oh, it's not in my eye. Partly because she needs the exercise and partly because it is starting to get dark already. <laughs> oh dear. See, I, I kind of had hopes that I could just whip her rug off and just tack her up and go, but she's got massive turd stains everywhere. Literally everywhere. Her backside is a disgrace right now, which um, luckily for you guys, you can't actually see. I mean, there's a bit of one up here. I don't quite know how she got that, given the fact that she's had a rug on, but there you go. Magic Nelly. But yeah, her butt's gross. Her tail's gonna need washing on the weekend. And I kind of looked at it and was like, eh, that's not a problem I want to deal with right now. So we're going out mucky, aren't we, bird? Going out in all our mucky glory. Okay, so the aim of today's exercise is speed, basically. <laughs> oh, good girl, Nelly. Good job. up like you're not properly warmed up yet you can tank it a bit on the way home but you're gonna do some sensible trotting first okay Nelly's warm-up trot is like Woodster's beast trot. <laughs> they are just polar opposites, these two. It's so funny. Yeah, see, it's never a good sign when everybody has their lights on already. Ah, well. We're going to go somewhere slightly different today, partly because I want to get a rough idea of how long this ride takes because I've not done it for quite a while um, and I feel like it's something that I want to start taking the boys on. It's just a little bit longer um, and uh, it's just somewhere different for them to go is what I really want because we're kind of doing the same two rides up the big hills at the moment, like the two road rides on the hills and I'm getting a bit fed up with it and bored with it and they must be getting a bit fed up and bored as well so I thought well if we scout out this one um because I can't actually remember how long it takes it's probably like an hour or so I would guess but I just want to get an idea in my head again because it has been a while since I've done this one um and yeah we'll start taking the boys on this one as well my only issue with this is I'm still a bit nervous about the idea of taking Woodster over that motorway bridge um yeah, not quite sure how I feel about that still, but I don't know, we'll see how he goes. Blue, I think I'm happy to take over the bridge. He is um, more predictable than Woody, so I'm a bit less nervous about that. All right. You caught your breath a bit? Are you ready to go again? Oh, she ready. She ready. Go on in. We've been a good nosy at everything. Since you haven't been down here for a few months, have you? This is 
actually, I have in the past had some sneaky canters along this grass verge, but we've had a lot of rain the last two days, so I don't think I want to risk it. It's probably really boggy. It's actually the main reason I didn't go up our little canter path today, because I just know it's going to be a washout up there and I don't want to get her hopes up and then have an argument all the way up the hill. <laughs> oh, she's got all the enthusiasm. Sods Lord, I bet we're going to get another train come as soon as we get over here. They usually come in pairs. Let's go fast. Any trains? Oh, no trains. Oh, steady. Yeah, we don't need to go speeding around the corner, do we? Good girl. Um, I should think this is going to be a much quicker ride than I'm thinking. I don't think this is as long as I remember it. We're basically going to come back down that track there. Good girl. So we used to have sneaky canters along here as well. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. You're on concrete, cheeky girl. But I've dug loads of drainage ditches. I actually remember when they first dug these. Um, me and Nelly didn't know they were here until we got like up to a fair Hamster struck gallop along here and she just kind of bunny hopped all of them. It was hilarious. <laughs> she did not want to stop. She was determined to keep going. Eager beaver, let's put your lights on. <laughs> Ellie, I don't think your legs are going to take you any faster, babe. I think you're maxed out. Oh, she's running out of juice. Need a breather? Yeah, have a breather. You've done good there. Well done. Well done, babe. Oh, I'm going to do a bit of stirpless for a minute while she's catching her breath. Oh, yeah. Oh. Steady. definitely understood the assignment today. She is all about that speed. <laughs> Need to get these boys this fit somehow. Good girl. Stretch. Yeah, good girl. This way then. Oh, you are actually getting proper out of puff now, aren't you? You've done good so far, bird. Well done. She's a good girl. She's loving life right now. She's loving life right now. You're a beast, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Catch your breath a bit more, then we'll go again. Good girl. <laughs> no. Like, I know it's got a little bit of dirt on it, but I don't exactly call this a canter track. No. Although that grass verge does look rather tempting. Maybe we'll have to scout that out one day, walk along it a couple of times and get a feel for it. That could possibly be a little canter verge there. 
oh, with a few ditches to jump at the end. <laughs> No. No. <laughs> Stop doing a 50 50, you cheeky bugger. She's like, she's doing like a half trot, half canter. Oh, wow, I forgot how long this little track is. Oh, 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 no. No. Ah, 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 ah. Don't you swish your head at me. Drain! Two drains! See, I told you they always come in twos. Oh, well, hopefully there won't be another one until after we're over it and gone. Steady. <laughs> Jeez, Nelly! She's really starting to argue with me now. Yeah, you're gonna need a breather in a minute, aren't you? Let's get over the bridge and then you're having a rest. Oh, oh, good girl and chill. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. No, that's enough. Catch your breath. Catch your breath. Nelly, you're fun. <laughs> Would you like to go for another blast up this last hill? And then you can have a nice long stretch all the way home. Yeah? Go on then. Oh, she's up for it. And she's trying to counter again. Lol. <laughs> Now, will the hill slow her down or will it egg her on? Um, apparently, it is in fact just egging her on. Oh, whatever. I shouldn't be letting you do this, Nelly. Right, no, 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 no. It's, it's naughty. We shouldn't do it. We shouldn't create that bad habit because then you'll think you can do it all the time. And we need to have some rules on the road, don't we? See, ever since that day, we took her and Woody out with the hounds. Um, and she learned for the first time in her life that horses can in fact canter on concrete. Ever since that day, she's been like, but we can canter on concrete, the hunters do it. She always wants to do it now. <sighs> Learned bad habits from them horses, didn't you girl? Have we lost them? Oh no, I think we've lost all of them. Oh no. 
Oh, we've got two left. Oh, nuts. Oh, I think it's smashed to smithereens. Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> no, Nelly. Oh, hang on. We better pick it up. We don't want to be litter bugs, do we? Oh, we've got three left. Oh, it was only one we lost. Okay. I feel less sad about that. But do you know what? You can walk home on a long rain, babe. Oh, we murdered it. Oh dear, God, you're a sweaty mess, aren't you? Good girl. <laughs> oh. What are the chances of that being fixable, do we think? I'm guessing fairly slim. Eh. Oh well, I can order some more. See, I think where we've gone wrong, I might need to get a few sets so I can cut them to size. Because they slipped down quite low on Nelly's legs. Um, Woody and Blue have got a lot more bone than she has. So maybe I need to get another set and cut them down a bit smaller because you can cut these so they're long, so they're shorter. Um, it's just like an LED strip in there. Come on, Trouble. Come on. Yeah, we might have to get you a separate set. <laughs> Man, I'm getting a sweat on. No wonder you're sweaty the way you march on, Mrs. You're not happy with me, are you, babe? You're not happy with me. <laughs> I ended up giving her a little bath. At least it wasn't a full bath. Like I did, I did hasty it along a little bit. You are gonna need a proper bath on the weekend, I'm afraid, but at least you won't be a sweaty, disgusting mess. I think somebody would like her dinner. Yeah, I need to put her other rug on first though. Let's put your other rug on, sweeties. Yeah, and bed. Yeah, bedtime, I think. Oh, better open your door properly, aren't they? Don't want you trying to squeeze through that gap. Because she will try and squeeze through it. Because she's a bulldozer. Right, mind of the way, tea. Bed. Tea. Oh, keep your nose out. Go on then. Off you go. Girl. 